Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And today, I'm here with an out-of-the-park baseball game in the league that I'm playing, in which I am the Minnesota Twins. Now, I did a past video out-of-the-park on setting up out-of-the-park baseball. And I will link to that um, as the end screen at the end of the video, if you want to go back and take another look at that. Um, and in that video, I had said that I was just going to take whatever job was offered to me, and I got the um, I got a minor league job as a minor league manager. But I had tried that out, and it really didn't work for me. They were making up names, and they were making up stupid names for, for players, and they would give the same name to multiple players the same made up name to multiple players for guys that they just you know either didn't exist or they didn't know who they were or whatever because it was the minor leagues so i decided to do the major leagues and in this particular scenario i'm managing the twins we will go and take a look at um the standings um, here are the major league standings right now. You can see we're in second place in the central at 45 and 46. Six games behind the Indians. Um, two and a half in front of the Royals. And uh, three in front of the Chicago White Sox. And the Detroit Tigers are picking up the rear. So that's where we are right now. Um, not doing all that well, really. I mean, we're under 500, so that's not good. Um, let me go down here and... Uh, no, you know what? I'm going to leave the sound on. I don't think it's really that... I'll, I'll lower it. I'm going to lower the sound. Um, so that it's not quite as high. But we're not going to get rid of it. So anyway, yes, I'm managing the Twins. We're playing a game against the Royals, and I decided just to break things up and for a different look, a different thing. It's not Stratomatic. It's out of the park. Again, a lot of the details about out of the park baseball you can find in the video where I talked about setting it up. Uh, they have baseball. They have hockey I know of. I don't know if they have football or not. I would imagine they probably do, but the only ones I ever see thrown in front of me are baseball and, and ho hockey. So, and a friend of mine is really into the hockey, the new hockey, the Hockey Manager 7. But uh, anyway, right now I am going to play the game against the Royals. So we are going to start the game. I've got Barrios pitching against Singer. We're home. Hopefully that helps us. So this is what it looks like. Um, and you, uh, let me see. Let me put myself kind of, well, I don't know. There isn't really a good place to put myself. I guess I'll put myself right here. Um, so anyway, we will... Um, so what you do is you say pitch. Um, right now we're in the field, so I'm telling uh, Barrios to pitch. And I, one thing I like about this game over Stratomatic is the graphics. The graphics of the game are very good. Also, another thing that's very good about the game is you purchase it once and you can play any season from the past. And there was there's an error on our first baseman. You can play any season from the past and you can play. Um, it, and once you pick a season, like if you pick 2020 and there's a home run by them. So they've taken a two nothing lead already. Uh, but anyway, once you, you pick a season, say you pick the 2020 season, the computer will keep simulating guys and making new players, new, you know, young players and such, going forward into oblivion. I mean, you can, you can play, you know, 25 years into the future, you'll have all new players with made up names, with, you know, um, computer generated uh, abilities because that's what the game is the game is based on abilities not on statistics 
they rate all the players in cer a certain set of abilities to get how good they are. So Kansas City has scored two runs on us in the top of the first. And we go out there to face Singer. First battery is a Reyes. He's hitting great for us. Uh, hitting 402 on me. The guy is crazy good. But I don't have many other players, apparently, that are like that. So, um, now we've got Josh Donaldson up. And Josh Donaldson went deep, and he got one of those runs back for us. Thank you. And that brings up Miguel Sano. And he walks. And Max Kepler's up. And he strikes out. So there's two down. And that brings up... Luke Voigt. And that's another thing. I'm just the manager. I'm not the general manager. The general managers will make deals and trades in this game. Acquire players that, you know, in real life, and this is the 2021 season, in real life aren't on the actual team, and that, that's a, the case here. We apparently, our general manager, went out and acquired Luke Voigt from the Yankees. So while most of the players are... Uh, you know, most of the uh, Royals players are actually Royals players. And most of the Twins players are Twins players because these are the Twins and the Royals playing. Um, you will occasionally see a guy that isn't actually on either of those teams. But in this game, he is. In this particular season, he is because our general manager went out and got those guys. And Barrios is really getting his butt handed to him here. I don't know what's going on, but he has two outs. I'm hoping he can get out of the inning. He does. So you can see here, and, you know, they've, they've got bars that, um, let me see if you can, there you go. I, now you can see it. They have, uh, you know, these bars indicate how tired they are. And right now I've got Derek Dietrich up at the plate. Let me uh, let me move myself back up here in a little bit. All right. Derek Dietrich is up. We're down two to one, so that's not too bad. He walks. Uh, Mitch Garver's up, and he strikes out. Orj Polanco, and he walks. Now we gotta we gotta do something here. Ramon Flores, and Ramon Flores gets a base hit. Let me see if we, no, we can't score. One out, base is loaded. We got to get some runs here. And Luis Reyes is the man you run up in that situation. That's a fly ball. I'm going to say yes, I've got to get this tie run. So, and we do. We tie the game. There's two outs, though, and Donaldson up. And he is going to fly out. So it's a good thing I sent the runner on that particular, that last play. Uh, Luan Diaz batting against Barrios. And you can see Barrios is still in the green. He's still okay as far as his stamina. He's just not okay as far as how he's pitching. And I think in the 2021, this is out of the park 2021. I think they do a better job in this of not showing you, you know, like, like when they have a base hit, sometimes like an infield base hit, an infielder will just hold the ball. He'll appear to hold the ball instead of throwing it. And you say, well, that didn't have to be a base hit. Well, really what the game is saying is this is a this is an infield single. And that's the way they showed it. And that's how it was in um, Out of the Park 2020. But in 2021, that still happens, but it doesn't happen as much. Because it's just frustrating to see a guy hold the ball and you're thinking... 
you could throw it and you could throw the guy out, but really the game mechanic is saying this was an infield hit and this is how we're showing it. So there's a lot of things about 2021 that are better. Of course, they shift the screen around. I'm sure you can see that the screen is shifting around. We are in the bottom of the third in a 2-2 game. Max Kepler up. And Max Kepler is going to fly out. And that brings up uh, Luke Voigt with one down. And he walks. He either walks or got hit with a pitch. Yeah, at Nixon. So we've got two on with only one out. And Derek Dietrich up. And there he is, the righty killer takes it deep. Which is great. Well, we needed that. We certainly needed that. We certainly got to win this game and get back to 500. Um, Mitch Garver is up, and Mitch Garver is going to fly out. Two down, and George Polanco. And he strikes out. And again, you can see uh, Barrios is still, he's sort of leaving the green and entering the yellow. But he's still not, um, he's not really close to gassed yet. Two down and uh, Lopez, Nicky Lopez gets a single. Two down and a man at first. And they're going to get another base hit. So really Barrios has to get Diaz out. And no, he doesn't. He hits him. Base is loaded. We need an out right here, Mary. And he got it. Nice. So, 5-2 lead for us. Ramon Flores up against Singer. He strikes out. Luis Arreyes. He's out. That 402 batting average is dropping. And Josh Donaldson's up. Nice home run would be great here. But he strikes out. This may be, um, you know, Barrios may have to hold him the rest of the way. One out. That's going to be a pop out. For the second out. So now you can see he's solidly in the yellow. He's entered the yellow. But we are in the bottom of the fifth. So if we can tack on another run or two, that might be good. Um, Max Kepler is up. Max Kepler is not going. He's flying out. One down and Luke Voigt at the plate. And he strikes out. And that brings up Dietrich. And Dietrich strikes out. So we're going to the top of the sixth. Rio still has plenty in the tank. And let's see that. All right, well, that was an out. But see, like in the past, they would have shown that differently. That was a bang bang play, but they would have shown it a little differently. Base hit. Two out base hit. Let's see if we can get out of this inning, I hope. Now you can see he's getting down near the end of the yellow. So I am going to, pretty soon, I'm going to have to have um, somebody ready 
in the uh, in the bullpen. <clears throat> but I'm going to hope to get him through the seven. And that, yeah, the guy mishandled that. That was an infield single. David McKay now is on to pitch for them, and we have Flores up at the plate with a man on and one out. And that's going to be a fly out. Two down. And Luis Arreyes. And he hits it down the line. Let's see. No. Out. We're still up 5-2, though. Um, uh, Barrios is still in the yellow. Okay, you got a strike out there. That's nice. Oh, boy. All right, we got to go. I'm going to go get somebody up in the bullpen. Trevor May. Gonna get Trevor May up. Go back to the game. That's a pop out. Thank you. And uh, El Alberto Mondesi is up and he strikes out. So he got us out of the end. Thank you. And Josh Donaldson is up at the plate. He's going to strike out. And is that a... That's a jack. That's deep and gone. So no, giving us a 6-2 lead. Kepler is up at the plate. And he pops out. And that brings up Luke Boy. And he strikes out. So um, Trevor May should be ready now. And he is. So we'll put him in. And you can see we got a nice, clean, fresh green bar here on Trevor May. Of course, relievers, they lose their stamina quicker. But he struck out Dozier. And that's going to be a double. Double or a triple. Triple. Good thing we got a 6-2 lead. That will be an out. No, it's a base hit. Are you kidding me? All right, strike out. So it's 6-3. We may have needed that, that sixth run. Yeah, now it's 6-5. The Trevor May, come on. All right. I just hope he gets out of this inning, and we're still winning 6-5. Because right now, he's getting his butt handed to him. Oh, man, and he's already tired. Are you kidding? All right, I got to get Gla a Glacius up. He's ready. You can see how quickly that bar runs out for relievers. Really 
So, if we could get another run, that would be great. There's a walk. Garver's up. Garver is thrown out at first, but we got a runner at second now. Polanco up, and Polanco walks. They didn't want any part of Polanco for whatever reason. <clears throat> Newberry's up at the plate, or no? Two down and Arreyes up. And that's a hit up the middle. Hope we, we can score. I'm going to say yes. And no, he's out. He's out. Had to try it, though. Right. All right, come down. And let's see if we can get the last out. No, face it. No. Come on, Iglesias. Get out of here. Get it us. Get us out. And it is. That's a fly ball. So we win the game. We hang on to win. So there you go. There's the box score. Let me get me out of the way. So there's the box score. Barrios with the win. He's 7-7 seven and seven on the year. Singer with the loss drops to 5-5. Five and five. So there you go. That's what we're looking at. And there we are at 46 and 46. So that is going to be, that's all for me. Uh, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.